We're going to install PG Vector on Ubuntu 22. Let's begin. So, here we can see that we're installing on this release of Ubuntu. With this, we're going to set up POST for Postgres and PG Vector installation. So to do that, we're going to run these commands. These commands will be available in the description of the video. Now that that is done, we're going to update, followed by the installation step. This will only take a few seconds. Once that is done, we're going to run this command. We can see we're doing a Postgres 15 PG vector here. Let's run that command now. This will take a few seconds. And now the installation is complete. So how can we validate? Well, we can run this simple command. And we see that it's running. Then log in. And as we can see, we can log in now and this is the version. Now the next step is to install the extension. Note that the name of the extension is vector and not PG vector. This can confuse some people. After that, you can validate using this command. As we can see, the vector extension is installed using this version. Next, we'll run a bunch of commands to validate further. We will create a table and insert a record. We'll create a table and record as well. Then we insert a record. We'll use select to see. As we can see, all is well. The PG vector extension is ready for you.